Hi everyone! Hi! What are we making tonight, Paige? Chicken Twitters. And I am going to butcher her name and I apologize, but this is by Valyas. Valya. Valyas. Taste. Hey. <laughs> Let Paige correct me. Uh, taste of home. So, and then what are we doing on the side? Cheesy cauliflower rice cups. And that is by New England da Dairy. So, here we go. Yeah. Hi, I'm Panay. I'm Paige. And I'm Paisley. And, and we're, we're the, the Pestos. Pestos. This is a dab of crazy. Make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And check out our blog for more recipes, funny stories, and our other social media. Let's, Let's get, get cooking! cooking. Okay, so we're gonna start with the Calif the California, the with California the, rice, the cauliflower rice, um, because it has to go in the oven, and yeah, so that we're trying to time things right. So I'm tired. Um, so you're gonna be literally just pouring it in, egg, garlic, and salt. salt. So. Give me the eggs. The two, the one egg or the two eggs? Oh wait, this one is two eggs. Do two eggs. Come out. And then cauliflower. Cauliflower? <laughs> I can't talk. Garlic powder? No, salt was what I was trying to say. Cauliflower. <laughs> um, two very different things. Nowhere near the same. And I'm just gonna, because she says one eight, so. Did put some in there. That's one eight ish. There is something in the egg, and I don't know what it is. That's just egg. That little brown thing? Yeah. You're gonna need about a cup. I bet. So I would do like half of that. Half of it? All right, cool. Is that enough? Yeah. Can I just use all of it? No. Uh -huh. So uh, Instacart did not bring me uh, cauliflower rice. It just brought you they brought me cauliflower, so I just, made it in the rice. Yeah, just I go, just pulsed it in my food processor. Your what, 1980s food processor? It's seventies, thank you very much. Oh, that's even that's even older. Hey. I was close. All right, rinse that out, and I will mix this up. And send her this funny gif of the gingerbread man saying, the muffin man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Grab a spoon. And then we take like a spoonful. Oh, look at that. That cannot be. So put a spoonful in each. See, she says put a paper in your... No, thing. we've always had trouble with that. So. Well, but we got a silicone one for that very reason, because you don't have to, so... Oh, I guess that, too. I love this thing. I do, too. Okay, um, so you're going to do 20, 25 minutes um, on 375. 23 minutes. That's what I think we should do. So while you're doing that, I am getting the onion ready. This looks delicious, honestly. Considering I don't really like cauliflower. I like cauliflower rice, just not normal cauliflower. I don't know why. Okay. 
But this looks delicious. That's because it has cheese in it. Anything that has cheese in it is always going to be delicious. So she says add egg, shredded onion, and garlic, crushed garlic. Um, but instead of crushed garlic, crushed, I mean, oh, um, shredded it. onion, I am going to just... Okay. That worked well. Shredded onion. Look at that. And you don't need, it doesn't make you, well, it might make you cry. Get those in as good as you can, and then make sure you clean off the, the edges. edges. Okay, let's get it in the oven. I say we put it in for 23 minutes. We're going to do like one minute less, not even one second less. Echo, set a timer for 20 minutes. Said to you, Miss Dash seasoning. Mrs. Dash seasoning. Oh, it's um, but I had overlooked that, so I was just looking in our cabinet to see what we had. She um, found something. I looked to see about Mrs. Dash, and there's all like all different kinds. So I found this tri-tip seasoning, um, but it's mm. mainly just garlic and onion powder. Um, Salt, pepper, paprika. That's so about one fourth. The cupper. I don't know. I can't tell what it meant. So, anyway, we're using that. Yeah, one fourth cup of mayonnaise. That's about one fourth. Let's add a little bit more. Just to that out. You never have too much mayonnaise. I like mayonnaise. Got my hair. Hair. Mm. Now I needed this whole entire thing of onions, apparently. Come here. Thank you. Now I just pour this all in. Mm -hmm. So she also asks or says to put flour in it. Well, it worries me though to add flour when it doesn't look like it's even going to cover it all to begin with. Let's find out. Yes, I did not get five pounds of chicken. Uh Oh. I've been on the wrong one! I'm kind of thinking of adding more mayonnaise. Yeah, let's do it. And more egg, just because this does not look. Then let's do it. And if there's too much, then oh well. <laughs> Yes, because in something like this, you can have too much. Or you can have too little. No, if you there's no too little because you cannot, once it's in here, you're done. There's no more adding or anything. All right, so I'll do another spoonful of this, and then I'll add another egg. Yeah, that's what I would do. And another, a little bit, because everybody Was, well, is there anything else liquidy? No, no, no it's just, just flour. Thank goodness we have more eggs, though. Well, and then we're putting flour into it as well. And it might soak it up a little bit. So I'm afraid that it's going to even more get... Now we mix. Because it's always better to make a little bit extra in a just case like this case. when you can't add to it later. So if you don't make enough in the beginning... I'm adding more mayo. Yeah, you are kind of a... I'm just kind of winging it at this point. Okay, no more... No, okay, that's a lot. Okay, add a little bit more seasoning, a little bit more garlic. Okay. Now we have a ton. So 
how much um, flour does One it call for? Cup. It technically says 0 0.25, but I used my brain and figured out that's one Okay, well you just like tripled the mixture, so... So we'll do like three-fourths then. Yeah. Um, I'll do like a half cup, maybe. So add that in now, and we'll... Um, See what happens. Then that way everything's all together, so that when we add it to the chicken, it just grabs to the chicken. Okay. Much easier with it all already mixed. Then trying, to, I mean, isn't that, does she say? She says put it straight into the chicken. Yeah, she does. And then mix everything with the chicken, but it feels like. That would be much easier. To, like it would be, I don't know, it wouldn't all mix well. Yeah. I feel like this mixes better. Aww. Slowly, carefully. Oh, right. Okay, bring that over here. So, okay, so. instead of sauteing on my stove, which would have taken forever, A, and B, all the oil splattering up would have probably caused me to leave the entire house. I don't like to saute. I don't like to fry stuff and no, have to deal with it. It's so. not fun. I do it in. The, I, I decided to do it in the Instapot. Um, it's probably gonna work, so that yeah. I don't have to deal. I still have some five minutes. I went. Ooh. Okay, so now I think I understand this better. It says. Um, oh, no. When oil gets hot, place one large ice cream scoop of chicken mix, of chicken mix into the pan or in spot. Um, and then pat it down to make a fritter. All right, here we go. Maybe. It says hot, but it's not that hot. All right. Well, we're going to be here a while. I guess we're doing it the other way. All right, well, we gave up on the Instapot idea because, well, it didn't work. So, so much for thinking that that'd be fantastic. So, now we're frying. But I'm still using my uh, my little guy to crack you the lid. You've had those for, like, forever. Yeah. Um, she, the, the blogger says to use... Uh, a frying shield, but I don't have one of those. Sadly. But I have this little guy, and what happens and is the lid just sits on his leg, so it stays vented. It's a little... So, we're gonna do that. The timer went off for these. Oh, yes. This probably still need me longer. I'm gonna say 10 more minutes. Wait, open it more? Let's go another five and see how it goes. Echo, set a timer for five minutes. Yeah, because they're still a little watery.
about this. All right, so grab the thing, put thing, the lid. I gotta take the piece that's in there out. We got one. We got him. This is very smoky. <laughs> it's a I am not a fan of the frying thing. Okay, I want to see what these things are supposed to- Oh, mine don't look like that. <laughs> <laughs> Does it taste good? This is our first tasting one. Um, will you put Turn. something there that I can- Pot holders or something? Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, those look pretty good, actually. Oh, grabbing everything. Oh, oh, those look pretty fantastic. good. Oh yeah, look at that. They feel Little good. Little cupcakes. They're little cauliflower cupcakes! I'm actually... Alright, let's tango again. Oh lord. I'm Will standing. you grab the plate? The plate is right here. Yes, I have a pot holder on one side and a thing Girl, on the other. put it on the right hand since you're right-handed. Yes, that's what I need. Oh, oh. Hey, don't, I don't want to knock it off out of your hands. It's good. I think you should be more worried about the chicken. Aye. So I was reading her thing and she says, um, variations, you can add cheese, uh -huh. herbs, um, cheese, herbs. Oh, no. How about we add it to the mixture now? And we'll have some cheese and some not cheese. Oh, grab that cheese. <gasps> I think mozzarella would go better. Want to use rest? Yep. All right. Sweet. Well, we did it! Kind of! <laughs> These look perfect! The fritter- the fr the rice cups, I can't talk. <laughs> the rice cups look amazing. Look at these. We cooked them for a little longer, um, than she called for, but oh, they came out perfect. Mm. So, and the chicken fritters, um, <laughs> well... They weren't uh, easy, um, but they weren't super duper hard. I mean, it all came together easy. I um, guess we weren't folding chicken. Yeah, <laughs> we've done that before. <laughs> anyway, I think we did it. Um, I think we should eat. Don't forget to look in the description below for our blog link. It has all the recipes and all the information. A lot of information. Head over to TikTok and see our tasting videos. Um, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Oh